What's going on, miners? My name is Chump Change XD. Welcome back to the Chump Change channel. I'm wearing a mask because I don't show my face. Get that out of the way right now. But today we're going to be talking about the LHR, unlockable driver, like you guys can see right here on the screen, and why it's bullshit. If you're interested in that, let's do it. All right, so let's get right into it. You guys saw me read this thing yesterday on a uh, video, and it was very, uh, seemed promising at the beginning, and the more I looked into it after the fact, the more it was uh, really red flaggy, I guess. And as you guys know, everybody made a video about it today. Uh, Red Panda let one out, which was very good. He actually went over a lot of good points in there, but he didn't catch this, and not a lot of other people did. My man Null over in Misfit Mining Discord actually did. So if you guys come over to this dude's scam YouTube channel, you notice that he has an RTX 3060 Ti 8 gigabyte memory GDDR6 Hynix, okay? Seems normal. Come over here, look at the mega hash, 61.24. Temperature 66C, and the memory temp is 74C. But wait a minute, there's an issue. There is no VRAM temperature sensor on a GDDR6 type memory. You heard me right. GDDR6 does not have a memory sensor. Oh, and then not to mention, if you guys haven't noticed, apparently this is minor stat OS. I personally haven't used it, but I'm being told that this is not the dashboard. So that's a, another huge like red flag. And not to mention, I'm pretty sure in Linux operating systems, memory temperatures aren't even shown. All right, so I just jumped over into my uh, Hive OS, which is my Hive shell. I just kind of remoted in and I want to show you guys, check it out. Right here, you can see the temperature. That is the core temperature on your GPU. The memory temperature, there is no column. Doesn't exist on Linux, at least this Hive OS Linux system. So that's three strikes. This dude's out. As far as I'm concerned, this driver's bullshit and it's probably a real scam. So if I can advise anything, guys, please don't go over here and download anything from this page. Don't tip the guy. Stop watching his stuff. Report his YouTube channel because clearly he's a scumbag. If you're watching, sucks to suck because, I mean, you're not fooling anybody. This is not okay, and you made a mistake. So better luck next time. I want to show you guys real quick. So the HW Info tool for Windows to read the memory temperatures on your GPUs, it says check the... GDDR6X memory temperature on your NVIDIA RTX 30 series GPUs with the HW info. So this entire article tells you about this GDDR6 memory type, okay? But it has an X at the end of it. If it doesn't have an X, these GPUs literally were not made with those temperature sensors. So this is just further proof to show you guys that I'm not lying. This guy definitely made a hiccup in his video and you know what? Yeah, so I mean, overall, this is really unfortunate. Obviously, I wanted this to be a true thing. Um, the driver unlock, you know, for what? The 3060 version ones, that was great. It worked good, um, but you know what? I guess we can't get that lucky again and I just I just want to give you guys a fair warning please 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 don't download this take this into consideration this video if I'm wrong by any means please leave it down in the comments below let me know if that was a good catch null thank you so much for you actually reaching out and showing me that bringing that to light because literally nobody else caught that Hopefully you guys learned something today. Hopefully you appreciated the content. If you did, please don't forget, go down here, hit this like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you haven't seen this video or this video, go check them out. You guys might learn something else. I appreciate you all for watching. Please stay safe. I'll see you guys soon. Peace.